I would have asked you earlier, but I guess I just assumed you'd say yeah. What, what if I if I won't? Well, well, I'd ask Mike. Well, he'd like that, Sonny. He would. Are you turning me down? Uh, what, what's the best man supposed to do? Um, get me to the church on time, stand next to me at the altar, hold the ring so I don't lose and them. And then I have to give a toast. That's... It doesn't have to be a, a long well, toast. It, it won't be. So, are you saying yeah? Yeah, if you want. No, yeah. no, no, no. If <laughs> you want. Look, if you stand next to me, that, that means you're giving us your blessing. It's important to me. I've had a lot of people I can count on in my life. Luke, Stone... And if they could, they would be there. But you, I still want to be my best man. You, you have covered my butt for over a year now. Anywhere I went, I was safe. If I wanted you to do something, you did it. If I told you something, you would not tell a soul. And now I, I am buying my life with yours. The fact that you are covering for me while I disappear means a lot yeah, to me. You understand I'm what I'm saying? Not, yeah, but I'm, I'm not doing anything you wouldn't do for me. You, you gave me a life, Sonny. You taught me what I needed to know. You treated me as an equal that night at Luke's. You loaned me 20 bucks, shook my hand like there was nothing wrong with me at all. Right? You helped me for no reason when I needed it. So why can't I help you now when you're the best friend I'll ever have? That's why I want you at the altar. That's why I'll be there. I know. <laughs> Honey! Yeah! All right, no, it's Jason. Good! No, no, whatever she wants as long... as long as she does not leave the building. Okay, thank you. Where were you? The church. Here, I'll get that. And then a hotel. I had to take another look at the ballroom and just right. move some flowers to make sure it was easier to watch the room. You have thought of everything? Yeah. Huh. Except the toast. Look, uh, I was wondering if it was okay if I, if I would say... <sighs> you and Brenda love each other. And may you always be together in the way you are tonight. You watch. Mike's gonna make a toast, so is Lucy, and they're gonna talk for ten minutes and not say half of what you did in two sentences. Yeah, well, they don't know they're telling you goodbye. Guess that makes me lucky. Remember that money you brought back? Hundred thousand dollars and a bus ticket to Florida? Tickets upstairs in the desk? Hang on to it. Why? In this line of work, you never know when you're gonna need a ticket out of state. You know, that's the same thing you said to me when I brought it to you? Then you offered me a job. If I were a better person, I'd like to go back and change that. I wish I had sent you home so you could do something legitimate. But hiring you was the smartest move I ever made. I'm not sorry about it. Neither am I. Your tux is upstairs in Stone's room. Change before we're late. Five minutes. Take ten, because on my wedding day, I want you to look presentable. Whoa, 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 almost forgot. Oh, it's your job to make sure I don't forget these at the altar. Right. Don't worry about it. I'm not gonna worry about it as long as you don't forget. I won't. All right, hurry. Hurry. I thought you were gonna quit giving me orders. Go.